you're going to see here is a, a picture of some kind of whiteness between the big toe and the second toe. Can you see that on that picture? There's a lot of whiteness uh, between there. And it kind of looks like uh, kind of some scaly and wet skin between there. And many times patients come in with this and they think they have athlete's foot and they've tried a lot of different creams and nothing really works. And here you can see I have this little lamp that's called a woods lamp. And with that lamp, you're able to see if there's any fluorescence or if it kind of shines in that area with different colors. And this one actually shined up uh, a little bit of orange. And this is a condition that is, um, is a kind of a combination of a couple of things. Uh, one, it's a combination of like a bacterial infection uh, that's on the skin, and so the patient should be on an antibiotic. Uh, a second thing, I think there is as well a, a fungal infection. But for fungal infections like this, a lot of times I like to put a patient on an antifungal by mouth for a couple of weeks because if you put them on a cream, the cream is gonna make it more moist between there. There are some other options of gel, like an antifungal gel that can be placed, uh, but sometimes if there's opening, open skin, they, uh, to make it a gel, it has to have alcohol, and that can sometimes be painful for this patient. So we'll put them on an antifungal and an antibiotic. I'll also recommend using lamb's wool to space out between the toes. And then there's a couple of different types of uh, drying agents that you can use. Uh, you can either use tincture of benzoin, you can use betadine or Castellani paint. And both of these are just used to kind of dry up that area uh, between the toes. So here's a, a condition uh, between the toes that's very common uh, for different types of patients. This patient had this for years and they were wearing boots for years and they just thought it was a, a fungal infection that didn't get better. Hey guys, thank you for watching Healthy Living. You're gonna find a few links here I'd like you to click. One is to subscribe to this channel on YouTube. Uh, also, you can learn more. There are some videos here you can see.